All right, let's move to the impressive collection of basketball talent that Penny Hardaway is assembling down at Memphis. Six foot nine forward Imani Bates is the latest commitment spurning Michigan State, that is, Oregon in the G League. He joins fellow top prospect Jalen Duran and a slew of highly ranked teammates uh, at Hardaway's NBA focused program. All right, Mike, Penny's team, they've yet to make the NCAA tournament, but would you consider what he's doing in terms of recruiting a success? Uh, I guess, I, you know, this is, I mean, for 40 years I've done this and I never paid attention to recruiting. It's not that I didn't pay attention if Patrick Ewing signed with Georgetown, but the pursuit of these kids and who gets signed, I didn't know. When they play, you know what was more important than Patrick Ewing? Maybe not more important. It was more important to me than Patrick Ewing signing and saying I'm taking my talents to Georgetown. When he got to the Final Four as a freshman and yeah. played in the final game against North Carolina. That was more important. So when Penny gets him there, and by the way, oh look, I, 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 I know Penny Hardaway. I sort of root for Penny Hardaway. I think what he's doing there in his hometown is a great thing. I know the amount of local attention and regional attention that he and that program bring. When they start to play and they won the NIT, they're moving up already. Yeah. When they get to the tournament, then <laughs> I'll be excited. Not about the recruiting class. Yeah. All right, so John Calipari embraces one and done in Kentucky. Everybody says, oh, boy. How did shame on you for doing that. Then Duke started doing it. And one of the most popular teams in college basketball the last 20 years with Zion Williamson, Cam Reddish, R.J. Barrett, they, they lost in the Elite Eight. So they didn't even get to a Final Four. It's hard to do it with first-year players. But Dan Wetzel of Yahoo had a great point. He said Memphis isn't trying to get a prospect to the NBA, just trying to do that. They're trying to bring the NBA to the prospect. And here's what he meant. They play in an NBA arena, obviously, where the Grizzlies play. Yes, they do. It's a big-time program down there. They sell out, and then with the name, image, and likeness. So here's a player in Bates that could have gone to the G League and made money. He's going to go to Memphis. You know, local and maybe make more money. Exactly. Make more. And, let's, and we also left this out. Larry Brown is an assistant coach. Larry is still coaching basketball. He's doing it as an assistant, and they have Rasheed Wallace on that staff. So if you're a young kid, Penny Hardaway is saying, you want to get to the NBA, look at me, look at my staff, look where we play, you can make money, this is where you want to be. Frank, you want to get to the NBA, look at my staff, and remember, check out the clips from Tuscaloosa, son. Yep. You can make more money here than you can make in the G League. Yeah, you're right. You're right. All reality. Yep. I guess we got to start paying more attention to recruiting. <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.